Hey sis, what are you up to? I'm making Huckleberry a playpen out of this old fence that I found so I can have friends over without him biting at their ankles. Well, you don't got to use this old plastic fence. I got something much better than that. The FXW Mini Paws Dog Playpen? Let's check it out! Hey y'all, Josh here today, aka the world's greatest dad. What you're looking at in this box is the FXW Mini Paws Dog Playpen. Today we're going to unbox this thing, put it all together, tell you everything you need to know about it, see if it might be a good option for you as well. So with that being said, let's, let's get, get it. it. So first things first, let's go ahead and get this thing unboxed and see what we're working with. So as you can see, these panels are protected with a styrofoam wrapping to make sure they don't get damaged during shipping. So we got everything unboxed and the option that we have today is the 32 inch with 16 panels. So as you can imagine, we have 16 of these heavy duty panels here. And then we've also got 17 of the actual stakes that stake them together. Now on top of that, they also give us our instruction book right here. We threw in some gloves. And then you have these little post footers that are made of rubber in case you're using this thing inside so it doesn't damage your floors. So next up, let's go ahead and take a little closer look at the makeup of our panels. These things feel pretty strong, definitely have some girth to them. You know, it won't be pushed over or ran through or anything like that. Plus they have this nice kind of black powder coating on the outside. So they're gonna be able to stand up to a lot of different weather. Now the connecting stakes themselves are fairly heavy duty and don't have a lot of flex to them. They also have the nice powder coating on the outside. And as you see on the top, you got that ball end. And then at the bottom, it's gonna come slightly to a point. Now, the reason for that is if you're using this outside, you simply connect your two panels and you can go ahead and put that in the ground and it'll help keep the pen where you want it. Now, if you're using this thing inside, obviously you don't want this thing ripping up your floor. And that's why they give you these nice little rubber foot stoppers right here. So you can simply just put these on and now you're not gonna mess up any type of your flooring. So when we want to connect some panels, we're simply just going to line up our holes. Then we're going to take our stake and we're going to run it right down through all four holes. And then we have the option to either leave it like this or stake it down in the ground for a little extra stability. So let's go ahead and get this play pin put together. So first off, we have an eight panel playpen right here. And if you pick this up, basically you're gonna get about four feet by four feet of play area, which is going to give you about 16 square feet of actual area your dog could play in. And to give you an idea of how much room that is, we went ahead and popped Huckleberry the mini Aussie in there. So you can kind of see how much room they would actually have to move around. So we showed you the eight panel option. Let's go ahead and connect all 16 and see how that looks. And with all 16 panels connected, we have ourselves basically an eight by eight area, which is going to give us 64 square feet of play area for your pet. So with this pen, there isn't actually a gate or anything, but if you wanna have an opening for your animal, you can either lift them in and out, or you can simply remove one of these, and now you've built yourself a little gate. So again, the option that we have today is the 16 panel, and it's going to be the 32 inch height. Now, besides the 32 inch height, they also offer a 20 inch height and a 24 inch height as well. Now, the size of the 32 inch panels are going to be 32 inches tall, and they're going to be just about two feet or 24 inches wide. Other than this been an awesome dog pen, other animals love it as well. So we're going to use it to make sure that our bunnies have an awesome playtime outside. You can even put chickens in here. So FXW also has some cool additions to enhance your pet's playpen experience even more. And what you're looking at here is the FXW Sunshade. Now this thing is sold separately, but let's go ahead and take it out of the box, see how it works.
Now this sunshade is very well built, and as you can see, it's got these little holes to put at the top of the stakes, and then it's got Velcro so you can attach it to each one of your panels as well. This is gonna be very handy in the hot sunshine to help keep your pets cool. So there you go, that's pretty much everything you need to know about the FXW Mini Paws Dog Playpen. Now what do you think about this, sis? I thought it was really easy to put together, and now I have a place to put Huckleberry when my friends come over, and I can split the pens in half, and have my rabbits and my chicken have some fun playtime outside as well. Yes, easy to put together, well constructed, and it's for those reasons and more, I'm easily giving this thing a world's greatest dad. And daughter. Two, two thumbs, thumbs up, up, and we say, say go out and get you one. one. Hey, one more thing before you go. I want to let you know that the FXW company behind this Mini Paws Dog Playpen is a big fan of the world's greatest ads in depth and informational videos. Therefore, a few weeks ago, they reached out to me and asked me if they could send me this product for video review purposes. Now, with that being said, all the thoughts and opinions expressed in this video were my own, and I always do my best to accurately describe any product I review. Now, I hope this video helped you out. We'll see you next time.